Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Dave the Balloon Dude here again. I'm actually starting another new series. I've already got balloons from the movies going on. But now I'm going to do balloons from video games. And today I'm going to start with a very basic, but very popular video game. That will be Pokemon. I'll be showing you how to do a three balloon Pokemon. For this, you need a round balloon. It can be any color. I prefer black. You also need a red and a white 260 blown up with about a four inch tail on the end on both of them. I've already started mine. Go ahead and tie all three knots together on the balloons. So it should all start out kind of like this. Now, pretty basic. Just wrap these red and white balloons around so they meet on the other side. Twist them together. Just like that. And then you want to twist them off from 45 and 90 degree angles. So if it's kind of a compass, you have the red on the north, white on the south. Bring the red balloon around. I guess that'll be east from your point of view. And the white one around the west. So just like this. Twist it again. So for right now, should have it pretty close to this. We'll do that again. We're going off in 90 degree directions. Right around this direction. Red around this direction. Do it again. Push them again. And then you might have to reposition them every once in a while to make sure that they're all even. And then you bring down one more time, the red, and the white. And twist them together. And you got a little tighter out there. That's been the most difficult part about this balloon, is making sure that they stay the, uh, they're all nice and tight and they're all the same length. A lot of squeakiness going on. Anyway. Okay. Alright. Now, if you can probably see it from over there, but it's a little bit lopsided. So, you just need to work on it a little bit. Get everything as even as you possibly can. Make it to a little shorter, and it'll fall good. I brought you in close so you could see better, and here's the Pokeball so far. And I did break off the extras right here, and I tied them off. But on the white, I saved a little bit, because I'm going to show you a four balloon adaption to this, which really does look a lot better. Now pick the side that looks the best, and take your um, black paint pen or black sharpie, and what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to draw a circle right in the middle of the of one of the whites of the top white and then you want to draw a black line going out and going back that way and then do the same thing on this side there we go and that creates this kind of look All right. So that is the artwork for the three balloon Pokeball. And now I'm going to use the same balloon. This is going to add in the black 260. And I'm going to show you guys how to do uh, how to do a fourth balloon expansion. Now I'm going to show you the fourth balloon expansion. Uh, for this, all you need is a black 160. It doesn't matter how much you inflate it, you're not going to be using that much of it. And a little scrap of white you'll have left over from the balloon. Now you start off by taking the knot of the 160 and attaching it right here to the side. Either this side or this side. I'm starting over here with this knot because it'll be easier to tie on to and when I finish on this side 
I can use these little scraps on the end to tie to the end of black I have left. But you can do whatever you want. So there we go. Tie it on the black right there. Now I've already drawn this side, so I was going to show you on this side to see how it looks. So then you take the black, feed it in between the red and the white. Find the halfway point, each other white. And you want to go back about half an inch. And where that is, you want to twist the black. Find halfway point again. You go to halfway, go a half an inch the other way, and twist another balloon, another bubble. So you got that right there. You want to twist another bubble, it's just about the same size. Right there, and twist them together. Then you want to twist a balloon. Twist a bubble that is slightly smaller than these two. So right about right about there. And bird body them. Push this one in through. And pull this up like that. There we go. I'll put this back in. Feed this black part back through the red and the white again. So you have that right there. Find out where it meets with the other two pieces. Go out a little bit and break off the rest of the black and throw it away. You don't need it anymore. That one's gonna have to be quiet. I'm in the hotel room. There you go. That went farther than I thought. I'm gonna tie off this black piece. And I'm gonna tie this knot to this leftover red I have left. Nice and tight. Black, so it's in between the red and the white. And reposition it all around. So there we go. Take my white piece I have left. Open up the bird body. Tie a knot in this. I should have done that earlier. My bad. So there we go. Come here. Now force the white into between the two blacks. Twisting the leftover knot around the black, keeping it from coming out. If it makes any sense, let me know in the comments. If that does make sense, let me know. We have both sides. Position it, and there you go. Now, honestly, this balloon does not take that long to do. I was taking my time for this video. You can probably make this in two, three, maybe four minutes in line. You can definitely do this version a lot quicker if you need to. But it's pretty good for line work, and uh, I plan on doing a lot more videos for video games. So if there's a video game out there you like or you want to see some kind of balloon from, if you, got, if you get requests from some video game you have no idea what to do, uh, put me in the comment section below and I'll see if there's anything I can come up with for you. Uh, go ahead and click subscribe. Uh, I've got one more balloon from Pokemon I want to try to put on. And uh, we'll see what we can do. Thanks and click subscribe.